Okay, the story I'm going to tell now is basically background about the IT infrastructure in these GP practices and issues they have around using technology. So, um, a couple of things. First, the GP practices do not have Wi-Fi. None of our GP practices have Wi-Fi and they don't have any plans to install Wi-Fi. And there are reasons around that, some of which are to do with security, some of which are to do with cost and the construction of the buildings. Um, so where you see me sat here with a laptop and the mobile phone, this isn't actually normal in a GP practice. It would be like the other stories where somebody is sat at a desk with a desktop computer. That's how most of their work happens, is in those consultation rooms with a fixed computer. Um, we do have some people who go out on home visits and uh, there, may, there are some issues there with difficulty perhaps in getting back in contact with people at the practice if they need additional support whilst they're out on the home visit. Sometimes it can be hard even to phone into a practice and get through to the person you need to speak to. So if a home visit ends up um, with a question you can't answer, people will often just leave it and come back to the practice and ask that question face to face. Um, now, what some of the reasons why we have um, restrictions on the IT, on use of mobile and Wi-Fi, is due to security concerns. All of these GP practices have some very sensitive data on systems, of patient data about their health, and therefore they have some quite strict uh, rules about um, connecting to these systems. Um, meanwhile, you also have the uh, bring your own device type um, movement happening where although the GP practice will not provide laptop computers or mobile phones for any staff, it's not, their, uh, it's not what they do, you do have many staff, particularly GPs, who actually have these themselves. Um, and so they do use these for their personal learning but um, this is not part of the general practice of the uh, GP practice, and nurses in particular would not tend to do this. 